Yes. Um, and again, you're raising money for a great cause no matter what. We also talked about the difference between uh, training women and training men. And the fact that, what, yeah. what, what, what do you say? Yeah, women, uh, they actually listen to you instead of argue with you exactly. the entire time. And then they pay their dues. That's right. Yeah. By the way, good news. Looks like we're back. Yeah, when you get a, you get a new, new guy in your gym, they tell you uh, exactly uh, what they're going to do, when they're going to do it. Scott Remley on his way to the ring. Urban Boxing DC. Lots of booze coming from the crowd. This is the Beltway Brawl 2 Battle of the Consultants. Entering the ring, fighting out of the red corner. He weighed in at 250 pounds. Fighting out of Urban Boxing DC train by Arturo Reyes. Here is Consultant Scott Rimley. All right, now we're talking, all right? If you're gonna bring a, a, a rap classic, yes. You hit him with, uh, not just by nature, not because I hate you. That's ya. right. That's what I was just going to say. Not because I hate you. Naughty by nature. Let's go. Um, should, should be said that Scott Remley in his, in his profile photo has glasses, no glasses in the ring tonight. Wondering <laughs> if that's going to be a problem, Matt. Do you think you should have worn them? What I always tell my uh, visually um, uh, impaired boxers is just to, to aim for the blur. Yeah, to squint really hard. That's right. I got you. Are these guys ginormous? They're too? absolutely huge. Oh my they're God! The second biggest individuals on the night. Scott Remley, six foot two, two hundred fifty pounds, forty four years old. Timothy Lynn, six foot two, two hundred fifty five pounds at thirty six years old. It is consultant on consultant action in this ninth bout of the evening. I love it. You know, just with the please the, welcome oh. fighting out the blue corner. He weighed in at two hundred fifty five pounds. Fighting out of downtown boxing club, trained by Aaron Harencia. Also a consultant, so we'll see whose ring advice is best tonight. Here is Timothy, the Striking Viking Lynn. All right, Striking Viking, great nickname. <laughs> Tarzan boy? It, it, what, Baltimore, could it be? Oh my God, it is. That okay, now we have a winner. I, Baltimore, Tarzan boy, not the most common walkout song. Uh, and clearly, so first of all, Striking Viking, Nickname of the night. Nickname of the night. Baltimore Tarzan boy. Walkout song of the night. It's not even close. Uh, Timothy so Lynn, let me see that. wins by emphatic first round knockout, I don't that's know the trifecta how USA Boxing for. scores this event, but I have to give the walkout song 10-8. I think it's a 10-8 round for And Lynn. it's not close. right off the bat. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. No doubt about Big it. Big fan. Big fan of Tarzan boy. Uh, I think he's from Maryland. Because it's Baltimore. Oh, there you go. There that's you right. go. The more you know. Don't know. This fight sponsored by Green Turtle. Your referee once again, Mr. Brent Beauvais. So Way to identify Tarzan boy right early. And I'll tell you, Timothy Lind wearing a red headgear uh, for the yep. blue corner. That's not something you want to see. It's often confusing for referees and officials to score a bout when you got two different colors going on the same corner. I'm not being facetious. I'm being completely genuine here. I have mentioned this in the past. Uh, these dudes are huge. <laughs> Gigantic. Take a shot every time I say that again. These guys are big, man. Again, small ring, big boys means tons of action early on. Let's see it. Round one. Oh. Um, I think there was there was a sneaky punch in there. This fight's over. This I, He's not going to beat that count. It is over. Now, uh, Remley is, it looks like possibly complaining about a strike to the back of the head, but I, I think he might have been grabbing his neck. There was a punch that landed saw, in that uh, exchange. Matt, Timothy Lind, Tarzan Boy, striking Viking, sub five second knockout. To be, I mean, I'm like, in total disbelief. I, I have no words. I have nothing. I, I will have to check with, with the bosses, but that has to be in contention for the fastest knockout in Haymaker Show history. In, in 30 plus events, that ha I mean, there's, there's, there's no chance there's one that was faster than that. I mean, I, 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 I'm, I'm at a complete loss for words, folks. I don't know. Uh, wow. Uh, Scott Remley. Thank you for raising a ton of money That's for cancer research. Thank Let's you for stepping for into the ring. Uh, but Timothy Lynn, I mean, Ladies and gentlemen, flawless the referee victory. Brent Beauvel stops the contest 
in the very first round. He lived up to his ring name. Winner out of the blue corner, Timothy, the striking Viking. Lee.